This is our story of everything. Our world, our solar system, our universe, and how it all began. This is what we think we know. It's a work in progress. The script is still being written. But let's see how it ends. New York City. A beautiful but unremarkable autumn day. Like thousands before it, and thousands to come. Until there aren't any more autumn days. Imagine for a moment traveling into the future for billions of years. Past the end of human civilization and the lives of all living creatures on Earth, Imagine we are five billion years into the future. The sun is running out of the nuclear fuel that gives it fire. As it cools, it expands and reddens coming closer and closer to Earth. It swallows up Mercury and Venus. Water on Earth evaporates, and Earth becomes molten again. When the fuel is gone, the sun's core ultimately contracts as it transforms from a red giant to a white dwarf. The expanding outer layers of the sun, called a planetary nebula, drift into space as ghostly shrouds of glowing gas. The planets that survive this process, the outer ones like Saturn and Neptune, are utterly changed by it. The planetary nebula blows away their gassy atmospheres leaving small, rocky, and metallic cores behind. The distant planets, no longer held by the less massive sun's gravity, drift into the vastness of space. Travel billions of years after that, and all remaining heat from the sun has radiated out, and its small, dark surface is the same frigid temperature as the rest of space. The sun is now a black dwarf. Now, billions of years later, propelled by a mysterious and only recently discovered dark energy, the universe expands ever faster, flying apart everywhere. On a grand scale and at a molecular one, Expansion overwhelms gravity. Everything rips apart. Not just galaxies, solar systems, and stars, but even atoms. Finally, matter itself is torn asunder. This is the big rip, the big rest in peace for our universe, the legacy of dark energy, that stuff we still haven't figured out. Right now, dark energy is mostly a code word for our ignorance, what the substance is. Some people think it's some sort of stuff. Some people think it's a constant that should be in Einstein's equation. Some people think it's just a reflection of the fact that we might have gotten our gravity wrong again. Right now, the big rip theory of the end of the universe leads the pack. But who can say if this will remain our theory or if some new discovery will challenge it? The stuff we haven't figured out yet, it goes on forever. One more blow to our centrality in the grand scheme of things.